guys welcome to my youtube channel and thank you for clicking on this video if you are new hi my name is lillian but if you are returning thank you for coming back and i hope that you are subscribed if you have not do so and do where to turn on the bell notification so that anytime i upload a new video youtube will notify you yes already we know how obsessed i am with the education sector in ghana i am particularly accepts with this university. The Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology is the best in Ghana and West Africa in terms of science, technology and innovation and ranks the 14th best in Africa. KNUSD is located in the heart of Kumasi in the Ashanti region of Ghana, having an area of about 7 square miles with a student population of about 63,000. KNUSD has a tropical wet climate with relatively constant temperatures throughout the course of the year. But the reason we are here today is not about KNUSD as a whole but about something unique that I'm discovering in Ghana. Some time ago a friend reached out and was like oh Lily please once you're done with the senior high school please take a look at the university hall we celebrate it it means a lot to us and i'm like okay i still didn't get it like i don't understand what he mean i mean where you go to sleep and wake up and go to school so what is the big deal about it okay because of my curious mind i decided to take a look at yeah then i bumped into this video by this guys this is where it all began <laughs> The University Hall, a united family of brothers, we rest not all here. Katangis, we are the great fellows. We are the best. Hope. First and foremost, we are called fellows or fellow Katangis and I would say that God himself is a fellow. Katanga is um, the best or simply because we dominate in every aspect and we excel in every aspect. This is a hall that won uh, the recent KNUSD Inter Hall debate contest and we surely are taking this contest. We have Katanga and the rest and KNUSD there are two main halls here and Katanga is a hall that dominates every activity that goes on here in KNUSD. I'm sure with this debate that is going to be national, I'm sure Katangis are well prepared and important already. These guys drew my attention. This is an old video. Yeah, after that, I said, okay, let's get to know these guys a little more. By the time I did, this was the next clip that I saw of them. And even though I was a bit afraid because I mean, like, waiting with this, like, what is this? I don't get it. I don't understand it. <laughs> Okay, so if you're familiar with the university hall culture in the universities in Ghana, I would like to learn more about it. Yeah, I actually like what I'm seeing, but it's scary to me because of course African movies when you see people like this, it means say they are juju people, right? <laughs> so 
I was scared for that but I see more videos and more videos before we get to more videos where I'm like okay so this is how you celebrate the whole you sleep in wake up go study and then get done with your studies and go home Ghanaians is it how you do it I let me let me tour their hall for you guys to see maybe this is why they are celebrating because it's beautiful I mean we are talking about a public university in Africa where <laughs> where sometimes the the condition of living i mean the condition of living for students is not that great but then for ghana to still pull this off like this maybe this is why they are celebrating their hall let's tour the hall and i will be back <music> There are many times you feel not right Tossing and turning through the night As that day goes by You seem like you're searching in the dark But when the darkness turns to light All the troubles fade away to nothing And it tells me everything's gonna be okay There are many times you feel not right Tossing and turning through the night As the day goes by you're searching in the dark But when the darkness sends to light All the troubles fade away to nothing Honey, trust me, everything's gonna be okay Oh, but I'm in shadow, but I get out of the day Obviously, this is beautiful for those who attended uni is this why you are loving it why i'm saying you are celebrating you are loving it is because of the next video we are going to take a look at because i could see people coming back to give back to their university hall do things impact the lives of the students that are living there currently even though they are done with their studies they still donate funds come together give back to the current students that are occupying the hall so i'm like how does it how do you do it i think we should go take a look at that video first so that you guys you guys will know how serious this is this is a big deal let's go take a look and i am right here i'll see you later we also have a university hall president and this is the SEC, that is the student chaplaincy boss. We also have our hall pro VC, hall pro VC in the We have one of the strongest fellows ever, Big Tech, Big Tech in the building.
Force Commander in Jennifer, Lebanon, Directing Staff at the Ghana Armed Forces Command and Staff College. He was the second in command, and he is currently the commanding officer of Ricky Britain. The Revealing Officer has attended all mandatory military courses commensurate to this plan. Notably among them are particular intelligence officers called in the Nigerian Army Intelligence School, Lagos. Junior Staff Force in Command and Staff College, Daji, Nigeria. Armor Officers Advanced Force at Fort Knox, Kentucky, USA. Lieutenant Colonel Ganga is a veteran peace who has served in Lebanon, DRL, Congo, Chad, and Liberia. It is my happy privilege to announce that the repeat officer enjoys reading and playing tennis. Senko, no. He's a married man, blessed with three wonderful girls. We are proud to present Lieutenant Ken Benga. Those who have problems with their sight are advised to put on their cameras and let's watch how in unison the gallant men of Catalia will prove in this great university. Us! Yes. The Us! Stand! Us! Peace! Heavenly Father, all praise, honor, glory belongs to you. And we did make a joy to celebrate the week with a team strengthening the legendary status for national development. On occasions like this, we try to cast our minds back to see where we were, how far we have come, and the way forward. I have zoomed duty as the home master on the 1st of December 2012, excuse me, 2014, and considering the year under review, a lot of projects have been undertaken, majority under the good stewardship of my predecessor, Dr. S.C. Fialo. A lot are yet to be done. done. Mr. Sama, let me use this opportunity to mention just a few of some of the projects executed. We've been able to provide balcony cabinets for safekeeping of food items and place of cooking for almost all the rooms in the great city Katanga. We've also done painting of students' rooms, which is a major project undertaken by my predecessor. Again, we've drained most of the sewage that hitherto were blocked and creating a lot of new sounds in the future. Ghanaians are advantage in a way. You guys are 
advantage especially when it comes to this issue of education and I would say many more because I've talked about a couple of sectors in Ghana here that I genuinely, honestly feel they are doing amazing. I mean, look at a public host there where people from all walks of life, from all family background, from rich, not so rich, poor, and of course the extreme poor once you get opportunity to get into school you get the benefits that every other person gets i mean i love it yeah you may not really enjoy life to the fullest like the other person but at least you're not going to sleep in a place that looks like a prison in the name of hostel in case you think oh it's expensive it doesn't come cheap it doesn't this yeah nothing in life is cheap but for me i would rather pay and get value for my money than pay less and not and not be able to enjoy my environment so i said let's i mean let's talk about this culture myself i don't understand it is there something else to eat or it is just you celebrating your university through the whole that accommodated you while in school or what because i don't know this okay i don't know this culture i'm new to it i have not talked about my educational background on here ever maybe one day we will we'll talk about it so that you guys will understand a lot of things about me and why i get confused when i discover some things in ghana and i feel like okay this is not something i'm familiar with anyways so that is that for today but i'm open to learning and the comment section is there for you to educate me more on why you celebrate the university hostess that you live in while in school i would like to know in the meantime i would like to know is this your hall was this where you are i mean was this the hall that accommodated you or are you currently being accommodated here or do you intend to be accommodated here in future i am open to learning let me know what is special about this new discovery you know because I, the more i try to understand ghana the new things i see and i don't understand and i like to know there are a lot more things that i couldn't show you guys but i like what i'm seeing so i'm open to learning and i hope that you did enjoy this video as i will see you in my next video bye